Hi, I'm Faz Zuffer. And I'm Ben Schroeder. It's Valentine's Day here at Harvard, but is love really in the air? We're not so sure. So we're here to investigate Harvard's romantic side and hope to find Fez a Valentine. Speaking of which, Fez, what kind of dating apps do you use? Tinder? Bumble? No, I'm more of a LinkedIn kind of guy. Ready? Let's go. Describe your ideal partner. Ideal partner? <laughs> Somebody who studies math. What do you study? Not math. <laughs> <laughs> do you have any plans for this upcoming day of love? No. Okay. I'm here with Dan Off Dean of Harvard College, Rakesh Karana. Every relationship starts with that initial interaction. Do you have any suggestions for a pickup line that someone can, you know, start off with? Well, I normally would not ask a 54-year-old guy for a pickup line. Um, but uh, since it's Valentine's Day, um, we could say, uh-huh. It's for you. It's Cupid. He told me to give you uh, that you should give me my heart back. How's that? That is <laughs> 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. So what are your plans for Valentine's Day? I don't have any. Well, what are you doing Monday? Going to class. Excuse me. I don't want to interrupt your dinners for too long. Just want to say Valentine's Day is in two days. If anyone here has a date planned, will you please clap your hands? That is cat. Do you have any dating advice for all the crimsons who are watching their president right now on national television? Just look at what I do and do the opposite. Go to Stanford. Just off the top of your head, describe some ideal characteristics that you will find in a partner. Owns land. Ladies and gentlemen, your president and vice president of the Harvard student body. I'm here with the team behind Data Match, Harvard's premier matchmaking service that has helped CS guys find dates since 1994. Quan, yeah. can you rig Data Match so that I find the perfect person? For some people, yes, but you're not attractive enough to do that. I'm sorry. I understand. We are currently at the Data Match weddings where I am about to be married to Ben. This, this should not be happening right now. Okay, here we go. The grooms now each have prepared vows that they will read now. Um, hi. So what are your plans for Valentine? Excuse me. A two. So like I was saying, what are your plans looking like for Valentine's Day? Well, uh, I can't really divulge. Do you have any constructive criticism or advice uh, that I should adopt and embrace in my own life to better find a valentine? So I think to find a valentine, right, you got to scream it from, from the, the tops of Harvard um, that you want a valentine, that you need a date, right? Okay. So my advice to you is, is go somewhere and yell that you need a date. Look for a date, you know, okay. let people okay. hear it. You know, you, you got to let, let, let it out, let it out. I'm looking for a valentine! Well, do you know what I think your biggest problem might be? You kind of know everybody. You're that guy. You know everybody. So I feel like maybe the ladies think you're a player. They don't think you're someone they can lock down. Are you kidding me? They think, think I'm a player? I think maybe. That might be the case. I don't know that guy. What's his name? Justin? Justin! See, you do hey, know that guy. Okay. <laughs> for Valentine's Day, anybody special you want to shout out? <sighs> I mean, there's a few people, but I got to give a shout out to my professor for my opera class. She is beautiful and a wonderful lady. Please be my Valentine. <laughs> um, I was wondering if you might have any advice for me as I try to find a Harvard wife. Okay, my best advice for you is very simple. Just be yourself. Oh, Aww. it's very kind. <laughs> Unfortunately, ma'am, I've tried that for the last three semesters and nothing has panned out. Uh, do you have do you have any secondary uh, insights? Like bottom of the barrel. Uh, fun, you know, funny never hurts. I think you know. Unfortunately, I don't have that either. Is there <laughs> is there anything anything else? There's a lot of young ladies there, and I'm sure there's one there for you. Oh. You just have to play your cards right. All right. So, what kind of plans do you have going on for Valentine's Day? Valentine's Day. <laughs> What? Galentine's Day. Galant Galentine's Day. Day. What's what's Galentine's Day? When all the gals get together. All the gals? Without the lads. What do you think the perfect date on Harvard's campus, what would it look like? Perfect date? What is there to do on Harvard's campus? Half is at 3 a.m. Half is at 3 a.m. Let's go. Without the lads. <laughs> so I'm not invited to Galentine's Day. 
unless you want to be one of the gals. Can I be one of the gals? Yeah, of course. Are you one of the gals? No. Ostensibly. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who's your celebrity crush? Ooh, that's a good one. Um, I'm gonna go with Doja Cat. If Doja Cat went to Harvard, would you be into her? Absolutely. What if she lived in the quad? If she lived in the quad, I'm getting on that shuttle every every damn day. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> so, is she one of the gals? What do you think? The board will decide. <laughs> the bo There's a board for the gals. Yes. So, do I need to go in front of the board of the gals to be Enough the gals? with the gals. <laughs> I'm like interested. I want to figure out how this works. Who's your celebrity crush? Me. I'm I'm my own celebrity crush. I like that confidence. I mean, I've heard Nick is pretty famous in South Africa, so I guess he's my celebrity crush. So do either of you have any plans coming up for Valentine's Day? Um, no, I want Fez to be my Valentine. Fez? I already asked him. I already asked Fez. Oh, no. Which of us do you choose? <laughs> Which of us do you choose to be your Valentine? You can't I mean, take both of us. No. I asked the questions. <laughs> I don't even know. Fez, all day we've been trying to find you. All right, I'm here with future president of the United States, <laughs> Noah <laughs> Harris. <laughs> Noah, do you have any plans for Valentine's Day? I do. So my, my girlfriend, who's who's actually student body president at BU, we actually we're gonna go we're gonna go out um, to dinner and um, yeah. After that, we're actually going to um, the bean pot hockey hockey game. Yeah. Very nice. That's a that's a power couple right there. Yeah. Wow. Do you have anybody special shout out for Valentine's Day? Um, other than my girlfriend, uh, d definitely definitely my mom. You know, she'll always be the um, central woman in my life. Shout out to Noah's mom. Yeah. Shout out to Stephanie, my life partner. I've loved you from the moment I saw you. You have been the best role model for our children. You are the best person I know. And every time I'm near you, my breath still goes away. Oh, wow. There we go. That's a 10 out of 10 answer right there. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, to play us out, Mr. Prazul Waglu. You can start oh, playing right there. Okay. Yeah. Thank mm -hmm. you.